hurt. Oh, yeah. I must have hit my head, but I'll... I'll live. Wait here. I don't have to listen to you. I don't know you. I just saved your life. Do me a favor and wait here. Who are you? You know, if I had to count all the times that I saved your life, you saved my life. Long way to go, and we don't want to be traveling at night. This will have to do. They got lights, which means they might have power. I'll look around, see if I can't find a generator. Is tell me your name.
What happened? Don't worry. They're not gonna hurt you. Or anyone, for that matter. What do you think happened to them? I'm not sure. Whatever happened, it happened a long time ago. You want me to move them? Please. not done yet. You can thank me for her proper burial by serving as a warning. You stand watch over her and us. Show the monsters outside that there are monsters inside. Generator should last us through the night. I'll stand watch. How did you know? Know what? That my memory was foggy. I never... No, when you found me, you said that if you were the one with the foggy memory, that you'd want some company. How did you know? You hurt your head. I assumed. Hell of an assumption to make based on a little blood. You'll need to learn to ration. We don't have much left. Oh, I'm sorry. If I'd have known, I would have... It's okay. You needed it. Good night. Can I ask you something about what happened? I can't remember before you found me, but I know deep down it's different. Tell me the world. How did the world end? It didn't. It just changed. Like everything, things change and you have to change with them. Adjust, carry on. Make the decisions that keep you going. No matter how difficult those decisions may be. The wise men at their end know dark is right. Because their words had forked no lightning, they do not go gentle into that good night. I think I was a teacher. Try to sleep. Maybe you'll remember more tomorrow. Wait. Remember my name. My name is Sarah. Good night, Sarah. Stupid risks. 
You don't have to be so mean about it. And you don't have to be a little bitch about hearing some constructive criticism. You weren't the one stuck in a bag the whole goddamn day. I know. But things happened fast and I had to make a call. What call? We're partners, remember? We take care of each other, that's how it's always been. But I found her, see? I found Sarah. I don't believe it. After all this time, now you find her? How? Come on, boss, you gotta tell me. What the fuck you looking at? Ah! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where do you think you're going? She's losing it, boss. If she starts screaming, she's gonna give away our location, and then the monsters will come. She's dangerous. I can sew her mouth shut if you want. Sarah. I'm gonna eat your face after I carve you up into two. Whoa, whoa, Let her go. Whoa, whoa, whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't you go sneaking up behind Tommy like that. Bad things will happen. That woman means a lot to me. She smells like raspberries. Let her go. She means a lot to you. Back inside. You don't trust me. How can I trust you? In this world, you gotta choose to trust someone. Take it. I trust you. Did I miss anything? Come on, boss, fill me in. Was it another monster? Ugh, I knew she was trouble. Shut up, Caitlin. First she eats all our food. Who knows what else she's capable of? Oh, good, the crazy woman has her gun. I want some answers. Okay. Why did you tell him I was so important to you? What am I to you? Everything. You're everything to me. I don't know you. I've never met you before today. That's not entirely true. What are you talking about? Tell me what's going on! She's freaking out again, boss. And what the hell is she? The name's Caitlin, and I've been Joseph's friend here for a lot longer than you have. Give her some time, Caitlin. I'm just saying she should drop the whole bitch attitude. The doll. She called you Joseph. Yes. That's your name? God, Jay, is the bitch deaf and stupid? Caitlin! I'll be quiet. I knew a Joseph. It meant a lot to me. I know that. He was your husband? Yes. It, no. He... my husband. Do you remember your house?
temper. how I died. It'll help me remember. Please, Joseph. You had cancer. The treatments weren't working. You were leaving me and I couldn't stop you. I remember like it was yesterday. So beautiful. Do you think Margaret will join me for cards later today? I really do miss her laugh. Margaret? Yes. She's my friend, you know that. Don't tell me you've forgotten. I have forgotten about Margaret. I watched as the nightmares took over. Joseph. I'm right here, baby. You need to save me, Joseph. Don't let me like this. Sir. Save me, Joseph. Promise me that you'll save me. I promise. Promise! I promise. It's okay. It's okay. I'm here. Here. Okay. He died the next morning. These symbols we have, what are they? They help me find you. Bound us together. Forever.
Welcome back to the land of living. Once you've recuperated, we can talk all about it. I found her, Ray. Sarah, I found her. no meaning there even though she died five years ago when i found her it's like she was new to the world you've mentioned time anomalies before but why now where was sarah before what's bringing you together now maybe i misread the translation and the tattoos limit the spiritual coupling to space not like i'm complaining and it would make for an interesting chapter of your book do you know where you guys are on the map yeah. As far as I can tell, here. But that means that you're heading? Northeast, to the ocean. And that is going to take you precariously close to head territory. It's the only way across, and the safest place I've found for us. For her? Safest place for her, you mean? Yeah, that's what I said. If you hug the forest line, you might be able to slip by without getting noticed. That's what I'm thinking. Okay. You should get some rest. There's something else. The Grey Lady, she made contact again. The Grey Lady? What happened? She scared the shit out of me, is what happened. That's four sightings out of the last five trips down. You think she's got a lock on you? I'm not sure. But. What are you not telling me, Joseph? She kind of threw me. You mean she physically affected you? She threw me across the room. Great lady has just always been a nuisance, a boogeyman. But if you're telling me that she's becoming more, this is too dangerous, Joseph. Too dangerous, Ray? I've died once a week for the past year. You've administered the last rites to me, what? 50 times? I know what I've done. I found it. That's all that matters. And the risk? I made a promise. secret. She knows she's dead. She's gone over the shock. She's dealing with it. So you haven't told her the whole truth then? Never came up. I didn't think it mattered. So it doesn't matter that you're not actually dead? 
Do you think Sarah would want that for you? That she let you keep doing this to yourself? It's not her choice. It's not yours either. I'm going dark again tonight. Just want to... No! Lies. Lies again. I have seen you. Our children are dying. And you watch. You watch them go. May I ask, when you watch them go, what do you see? Nothing. Why are you expecting to see anything else? I don't know. I'm not sure. You are wounded, my friend. Your eyes betray the strength you want with the weakness that you are. You have come to seek my help. Do not lie. Yes. You seek the answer to a question better left unasked. You seek death. Yes. Drink. What is this? The answer to your question. Drink. <sighs> your search has only one possible. Without coercion, 
or force. Should something happen, a copy of my updated will and testament is being held at the law offices of Parks and Vale Associates. Are you ready? Always. Come back. Again. said, Mercy shall be built up forever. Thy faithfulness shalt thou establish in the very heavens. I have made a covenant with my chosen. I have sworn unto David my servant. I commend thee into the arms of our Lord of earth, preserver of all mercy and reality, and the Father creator. We give him glory as we give you into his arms and everlasting peace, to be prepared to return into the dense reality of God the Father. How could I forget? That was a lot of fun. Fun? I think you and I remember the valley very differently. Maybe. But the valley was where I met you. Remember, you're close to Had territory. Don't fire your gun or they'll hear you. And make sure you have shelter before nightfall. It's not safe here at night. I'll be fine. Okay. And that's that. Go, get out of here. I wouldn't have found Sarah without your help. I'm indebted. There is one thing. I want you to find my parents. I never got the chance to speak with her. What was she? 
She was a friend. Some food, some tools, not much. He was carrying some kind of spear gun. And this. Hmm. Let me know as soon as they turn up. Or you find them. You, uh... Wouldn't happen to know anything about my missing patrol now, would you? The hat will see you now.
Joseph, so nice to see you again. Oh, and you've brought a friend. What's your name? Sarah. It's a pleasure, Sarah. Are you hungry? What's mine is yours. Thank you. Joseph, sit. Eat, drink. The food isn't poisoned, you know. Paranoid as ever. There's one thing about you, Joseph. You're consistent. Quite an appetite. Looks like my man found you just in time. When did you last eat? A couple days. So, what brings you to my territories? Just passing through. Really? Where to? Oh, it's a secret. I like secrets. That's why I like you. So dark and mysterious. Okay. Thank you, Brill. You really should try this meat, Joseph. It's so tender, perfectly cooked, worth dying for. I'm fine. We haven't talked about your tribute as of yet. I get anything I want here. I routinely have and do. I ask you to not make me do what I will, if you make that request. Are you trying to intimidate me? Is that a threat? Not a threat. I can see you like her. I rescind my request. Tomorrow, you will leave here. You will not come back. Good night. Pleasure. Stay the night. He's a little eccentric, but don't mistake his charisma for compassion. We're not safe here. He took our weapons, our supplies. We're defenseless. We've been traveling for days. We finally have a decent bed. Is it too much to ask for one night with my husband?
Scar, but so, what were you thinking, Joseph? I don't remember doing it. You don't remember taking a knife to your face? You're lucky you didn't lose your eye. It was the knife I used to carve the markings in Viserra. I'm worried, Joseph. This isn't right. You can't keep doing this to yourself. It's affecting you too much, and you're not in control. I know it appears. It appears? Me. Joseph, you tried to kill me. I'm sorry. I don't know what happened. I know you don't want to hear this right now, but even you've said it before. But what if it's all inside your head? When you go dark, you're someplace between life and death. What if your brain is filling in all the blanks? After everything you've seen. Heard. From you. Yes. From me. We're in this together. Joseph, how do you know it's real? Looking for Mrs. Bennett? And Mrs. Bennett? What if you're wrong? What if we are wrong? What's this about? Mr. Bennett, you don't know me, and this is all gonna sound a little weird, but. Does the name Caitlin mean anything to you? Well, anyhow, I just wanted to tell you that. Kaylin says she's okay. She wanted you both to know that. I don't know who you are or what you're doing here. It's taken this long for us to come to terms with the fact that we're not having children. And now you show up. I didn't. We were going to name her Caitlin. How could you possibly know that? Get off my property before I call the police.
Do you believe in angels, Mrs. Bennett? Or your daughter, Caitlin? She's my angel. He took with him Peter, James, and John, and began to be distressed and agitated. And he said to them, I am deeply grieved, even to death. Remain here and keep awake. He came and found them sleeping. Simon, are you asleep, he said. Keep awake and pray that you may not come into the time of trial. The spirit is indeed willing, but the flesh is weak. The Gospel of the Lord. In the shadows of the garden, we find a place of unfulfilled dreams, of broken promises. Faced with what he knows will be a horrific death, Jesus asks his apostles the simplest of all tasks, to simply stay awake. Not to help him fight, not to help him escape, but to simply stay awake and keep him company in his last moments. It's so easy to wage war on behalf of something, on behalf of an idea to simply stand guard and witness an end. Sometimes faithfulness fails. Sometimes the night's cries are far too soothing a song. That their embrace fades away all commitment. And that all the best intentions are lost in a blanket of fear and tiredness. Stay awake. That's all he asks of us. Stay awake and stand watch. Be gentle. My husband. They took him. Your husband's gone. Honey, no one leaves the pet. It'll be okay. You're with us now. The hat has claimed you. Like us, you're his now.
watching them score them. You're, uh, not thinking about leaving now. What do you think, Joe? I changed her style. Something I can really get behind. Let her go! You may have noticed I let you have your armor back. I'm not a heartless monster. Oh, no. But you're about to meet one.
Gus, it's okay. Get back. Just snap out of it. Send me back. I have to go back. Just, just calm down. Send me back! It's okay, Joseph. I've got you. I'm just going to give you a mild sedative to calm you down. Just relax. You're safe now. Yes. I don't think I'll be able to handle them by myself. Thank you, Jim. You should be terrified right now, but you're not. What's your dirty little secret? We're already dead. That's it? How utterly disappointing. I've known that little truth for a long, long time. Knowledge is power. That important piece of knowledge will make me a king among men. You can give yourself freely to me. I could make you my queen. We could together rule wherever the hell it is we are. Have it your way. Eternity can be a long time. assault on the hat's lair. Get her back. Joe. She needs me, right? I have to go back. You can't. I'll do it without your help. You can't, Joe. Not this time. Why? What did you do, Ray? You're destroying yourself, Joseph. I did what I had to. Where did you put it, Brent? Where did you put it? Do you know what you've done? I'm saving your life. I had your formula analyzed. You're ingesting a drug called scoplamine. How dare you? Better known as devil's breath. Scoplamine is known to cause hallucinations, memory loss, and it's part of the compound that you're taking. You're not well, Joseph. You're sick. And I want to help you. I'm sorry that you feel that way. But Sarah needs me. And I will not let her down. What are you doing? 
Joseph, I've already called my friends at the hospital. They'll be here any minute. Look, we're gonna get you help. All of us, together. You think I'm insane, is that it? No, but, but I think you're not well. Now, I should have been a better friend. You helped me. She... It doesn't matter. All you've done is prevented me from coming back. Joseph. Not from dying. No, no, no, wait, wait! How do you know you'll go back to the same place? If you take your own life in this manner, you might end up somewhere different. Wherever it is you go, where you've been, there's a process. But this? This? This is a leap of faith. Drop the gun. Now! You don't have to do this.
Well, look who finally decided to show up. What took you so long? I've been waiting here for a fucking hour. The ground's heavier than I thought. I'll leave you alone for five minutes, I swear to God. You came back for me. Don't be stupid, Joseph. I never left. You gonna stay in that hole all day, or are we gonna fuck some shit? Give me a second. I have a better idea. How about I give you your big boy pants so you can stop being a little bitch? That's it. It's ready. Good, my foot was starting to fall asleep. Hey, Joe, be honest. Does this ball make me look fat? You don't have to do this. You know that, right? I see the way you look at her. I want someone to look at me that way one day. And besides, you said energy can't be destroyed, right? It just finds another place to exist. Name another spark plug you know like me. You're one of a kind, Caitlin. Damn right. Caitlin, thank you for everything. Just like you, I never had a choice. Because I love you. Always have. Enough of this pussy shit. Let's get your wife back. Shit. Honestly, over here.
I think we should just stay here. There was never any hope. You're a persistent fucker, aren't you? Joseph! Your wife and I had some quiet time. And she let me in on a few things while you were six feet under. Most pertinent would be, we're all dead. Wherever the hell we are, we have long since shuffled off the mortal coil. That is a fact that you know, she knows, and I know. Less pertinent would be that I was the best lay your wife ever had. I've had my fun. And since we're all dead anyway. No! Please, don't. What? Why are you afraid? Why should you care if I put this imaginary bullet into her imaginary head? I do whatever I want, whenever I want. Because there are no repercussions, ever. There's no magic man up in the sky judging good and bad. Wherever the hell we are, there's no God here. And in his absence, I know. Just let her. No! And now for the silence. So you're the hat. In all honesty, I thought you'd be taller. Last chance, leave my friends alone. I'm warning you. Are you actually threatening me? What the fuck? Oops. Looks like the hat lost his hat. Although now I see why you wear it. You should probably put it back on. Who do you think you are? Me? Oh, I'm the bomb. Boom.
me here. Mr. Morgan, you murdered a priest. You exhumed your wife's body and carved symbols in her flesh. Where else do you think you should be? It says here they have you on haloperidol shots. Pretty strong stuff. They're for my hallucinations. We both know they're not hallucinations. Are you lost? I don't know. I think I'm looking for someone. Everyone's looking for someone here. We can live together if you want. I know you lost your son, and then your wife. I know how hard that can be, the places it takes you. I lost my daughter. I'm Sarah. Mr. Morgan, what you've accomplished. Will you help me? Where am I? We should get moving. Long way to go. siyasi iktidar sahibi olması demektir kut anlayışı. Ülük Tanrı'nın iktisadi güç kazanlarması ka- Kaan'ın da bunu adil şekilde dağıtmasıdır. Küç Tanrı'nın Kaan'ın savaş yeteneğini arttırmasıdır. Kut, Ülük, Küç hükümdarın sahip olduğu yetkiler. Kut, Ülük ve Küç arkadaşlar. Hükümdarın Görevleri incelendiğinde Türklerde sosyal devlet anlayışının geçerli olduğu anlaşılmaktadır. Şöyle örnek verirsek, töreyi uygulamak, toy düzenlemek, adaleti sağlamak, açı, yoksulu giydirmek, yedirip içirmek diyebiliriz. İlk Türk devletlerinde ülke doğu batı diye ikiye ayrılırdı. Buna da ikili teşkilat denirdi. İslamiyet öncesi Türk devletlerinde hükümdar çocuklarına tidin adı verilirdi. İlk Türk devletlerinde devlet meseleleri büyük meclis olan kurultay. Bir diğer adlarıyla Toy Kengeş adı verilir. Kurultay Toy Kengeş. Türk devletlerinde kurul ve meclislere bakacak olursak Avrupa Hunları seçkinler meclisi demiştir kurultaya. Tamgaçlar Nazırlar Meclisi. Hazarlar İhtiyarlar Meclisi. Peçenekler Komenton, Tuna Bulgarları ise Millet Meclisi demişlerdir. Kurultaya Kaan baş, başkanlık eder, yokken yerine Aybucu yani vezir kurultaya başkanlık ederdi. Yönetim ile ilgili e, ayrıca kurultay üyelerine de Toygun adı verilirdi. Bir bilmemiz gereken de yönetim ile ilgili bazı kavramlar. Ayuki, hükümet, bakanlar kurulu aynı zamanda. Ağılık, ağıçı, hazine görevlisi. Ayguci, vezir. Buyruk, bakan, hükümet üyesi. Şat, hanedan üyesi. Tamgacı, bitikçi, tuğracı, yazışmalardan sorumlu olan kişi mühürdar. Tigin, yani Tekin, Kaanoğlu, Tudun, 
Vergi memuru ya da vali bir diğer ismiyle. Yarlık hükümdar emri. Apa sivil yönetici. İlteber erkin yüksek devlet memuru veya idareci. Tutuk askeri vali. Emçi otacı tabip. Subaşı ordu komutanı. Tayanç kenetçi danışman. İnanç inal ataman figinlerin eğitmeni. İç buyruk saray memuru. Vahşi öğretmen. Kün halk demektir. Devam edecek olursak. Toplum, toplumsal yapıya bakarsak. Burada il, budun, bot, uruk, oğuş. Yani il devlet, budun millet, bot, boy, uruk, soy, oğuş aile. En küçük toplumsal yapı oğuş aile unutmayalım. Anne, ök, baba, kank. Toplumda tek eşli evlilik yani monogami geçerli olmuştur. Oba, çadır, evdeş, ev, egne, yumuş, çeyiz. Ülüş, bay, törün, düğün demek yemeği. Türklerin en önemli savaş usulleri sahte ricat ve pusu. Askerliğe bakacak olursak. Türklerin en az değişime uğrayan o, o, olan e, teşkilat ordu teşkilatı. Düşmanı gözetleyen casus ve teşkici gelme, gelme adı verilmiş. Askeri başlıklara bird ya da tolga denilmiş. İpek ve Kürt yolu önemli ticaret yollarıdır. Türkler hükümdar mührü vurulmuş bez parçaları yani kamdular kullanmıştır. Madeni paralara ise yarmak denmiş. Uygurlarda ticari ödeme aracı olarak böz, mühürlenmiş kumaş parçaları, kuampo resmi formatta bez, kumaş ya da çal, kağıt para kullanmışlardır. Devam edelim. Dinle devam edersek. Gök Tanrı inancı var İslam Efendisi'nde. Gün adamlarına kan ve baksı adı verilmiş. Yu cenaze töreni ziyafetlere yu aşı denmiş. Mezar, kurgan en önemli kurganlar eşik ve pazırık kurganı. Şu an Rusya'da Ermitaş Müzesi nedir bunlar arkadaşlar. Mezar taşına balbav ismi verilmiş. Cennet uçma, cehennem tamur. Ongun kutsal sayılan olay ya da totemdir. Eşük kefen, umay tanrıca ya da ya da taşı kutsal taş olarak kabul edilir. Hukuk, törenin değişmez hükümleri vardır dört tane. Bunlar faydalık yani uzluk, eşitlik, tüzlük, insanlık, kişilik, adalet, konilik. Türklerin kullandığı takvimlere bakacak olursak. 12 hayvanlı takvimi, hicri takvim, celali takvim, romi takvim ve miladi takvim. 1 Ocak 1926 güneş takvimi. Buradan tekrar hatırlatma gerekirse toplum, toplumsal yapıya bakarsak. İl, budun, boy, uğruş, uruk ve oğuş. En küçük toplumsal yapı aile, oğuş. Başka önemli olarak Türklerin en az değişimi uğrayan e, ordu teşkilatı olduğunu bileceğiz. Onluk sistem mekanda demememiz gerek. Burada hukukun töreni değişmez kuralları uzluk, konilik, tüzlük ve kişilik bunları bilelim.